what's up everybody this is a long requested video and today i will be showing you my current stockpile so here we have my paper towels um literally i can only show you what's on my shelves because before beginning uh my stockpile over i just recently gave away a lot of items since the covid uh, has happened as a couponer we always have the knowledge look at that one it's already open gee whiz and uh, I don't hold on to things I, I see people that have a need I try my best to give over to them what I have and not be selfish so rather than try to fill up a whole shelf or two um, I just decided to show you guys um, what I have on hand now and my stockpile is like located outside in my garage and I've been at the same house for 21 years. So yes, it has much needed repairs out here in this garage, but it works for me. So here you have some toothbrushes. Um, just a couple of packs of toothbrushes here that I keep in this little tight little cubby here. And this used to be a large work area for my husband. He was loving enough to let me do my stockpile out here. And here's my mouthwash. So please forgive all the holes or the bad looking walls but it is a garage and it's my safe haven out here um and my stockpile runs along the edges of the walls of the garage as much as possible uh we do not have a large garage but it pretty much houses what i needed to house and here is my toothpaste it is colgate i love colgate and then of course any couponer has a pleather of crest and this is even after i've donated several boxes and got rid of much as i possibly can each year i have two giveaways for you know especially for back to school and our churches and seniors so i'm always giving something and it's okay uh here i have my fall sheets that are left i cook as well so i try to keep a large amount of those on hand and my sandwich bags storage bags you know those storage bags we get from Walgreens all the time I love those because every time they come I grab some and I have my one lonely little trash bag here inside I do have a couple of boxes of trash bags that I keep inside of the house but as far as a uh, stockpile no and uh, here are a couple of bottles of wipes that I've had uh, since the pandemic you know before the pandemic and here are those faithful Cottonelle wipes that my husband loves <laughs> And I have two lonely little short dogs, as I call them, and some um, hand, sanit um, hand soap and some alcohol here. Like I said, uh, my water bottle, my bad. Let me move that. Yeah. And so, <clears throat> excuse me, favorite part, one of my favorite parts is my dishwashing liquid. I love to keep a stock of that. And I'm very meticulous about how I keep it. So here you have the game brand and the lemon zest that just came out. The blue is to die for. I love the... Uh, the purple but the blue is really good in the original of course and down below I have my palm olive and oxy as I told y'all on my previous videos I love it love it love it and see I'm looking at my palm olive and notice that one of them is in the wrong facing the wrong way and I'm just that's just me guys not tripping and flipping but that's just the way I am and down below I have some Ajax I sell my things up according to the colors and the kinds so that I'll know that when I'm going to the stores particularly what I need to refill and replenish and again this just is how it looks uh, we didn't paint the shelves or anything and like I said here's a few bottles of cleaners uh, Clorox and one lonely little toilet uh, bowl cleaner and of course I have some in the house uh, in each restroom uh, I have Lysol spray on hand and uh, I found these a couple of weeks ago at a grocery store and this is one of my prized possessions I love it it's Mr. Clean everybody has what they love and that's what I love I love Mr. Clean I love the gang scent any scent is okay but I really love the gang scent I have a couple of bottles of awesome you can find that on your local Dollar Trees uh, some soft scrub in the back back there in a uh, what you call it uh, a lime rust thing cleaner so here's my tissue this is where I really need to work at <laughs> I have some northern quilted northern down there some Scots and then I have Charmin and um, one of my favorites which is Scott tissue 
last week I believe it was they had it bought buy one get one half off and I grabbed a couple of packs but this upcoming week is going to be on sale for 20% off I don't know in one lonely angel off we go through paper products like it's crazy and here is some bleach that I keep on hand um I have a smaller one um and that's just when I'm doing things inside the house or whatever up here I like to keep my bigger bottles of uh, laundry detergent you know um here's a tie simply I'm gonna go get some of that tie simply that's attaching to that tie coupon and one long one lonely little tie pod and I got this son a while back uh it was on sale and it was a baby laundry detergent as well uh and I just keep those just in case of emergencies and so here we're coming up on our uh my shelf of unstoppables and uh fireworks and things like that and as you can see like i said i wasn't going to try to go fill up shelves just to show you a stockpile i actually wanted to just show you literally what i have on hand and these are some of the supplies that i don't really use all the time but i do have them on hand and then we move over to my laundry uh shelves and, uh, i like to start from you know the bottom down and then kind of work my way up and so as you can see I have my swivel tail my swivel tail down here uh, as well as you know like a small the smaller ones when there are small loads and not that many clothes and the bigger bottles I try to make those use those first and then the little ones just in case we need some before I get to the store and my snuggle wuggles I love snuggle detergent and I have a co-worker who swears by snuggle y'all she loves it so I have to make sure that I keep a stock of that just in case she needs some and uh, like I said, I like to have stuff set up just by, you know, the brand, the color. That's just me. That's how I do it. And here's some downy infusions. I love the purple. Oh, my God. I love the purple. And then over here, we have some blue uh, regular downy, you know, our OGs in the house. And uh, I have the blues with the blues and the pinks with the pinks. And again, that's just how I am. I like everything to be color coordinated, brand, color, you know, coordinated. And then we're going to move on up top. And this is where you start to get into... Uh, okay, I forgot my little couple of bottles of, lo of Gain Laundry uh, Fabric Softener over here. Uh, I need to really replenish it. I really need to consider painting my garage. But anyway, uh, here's the detergent. We're going to start getting into the detergent. And here's some Arm & Hammer. And I need to get out so I can go get some more of that. Buy one, get some free or whatever it is going on. I need to get to that to do that and I like to like I said keep everything coordinated so that when I'm looking for something I don't have to scramble and try to look behind I can just look on my shelves and instantly tell what's what and here's the Tide Simply Oxy and Clean Fresh and I have a lot of Oxy because I like that Oxy and again as you can see the shelf is clear right there which means I'm using it I'm not keeping it on the shelf just to make it look pretty no um the, the empty spots are because either I've given some away I've did bundles, I've did whatever, um, and here is my game. Or for the most part, it's because that I really need to just refill that. I try to keep a certain number, you know, a certain amount in stock. Look at that old school game back there. It's a, a, a apple mango scent. Yeah. So up above here we have the Tide, and uh, I like my, like I said, I like my Oxy Tide Oxy. And you know that we used to have some Oxy detergent, and it's gone now can't find it anywhere and up above that starts my Tide Pods right over my Tide again I like to be you know just organized that's just how I am and uh, this is not like I said it's not just for the video anybody who knows me my family anybody can get on here and they can come in they can let you know the garage looks crazy but guess what's gonna be always intact and it's gonna be my stockpile and so I have some game flings over here and again arranged by their scents and I only have one little blue one. I need to go get some more. Yes, I need to get some more. And then I have my Tide Simply Pods as well. And uh, we're going to move on to the next section. Um, but for the most part, just like I said, this is how it goes for me. Uh, my son, he really is good about the inventory. Letting me know that, Mom, you know, your shelf's getting empty. You might want to, you know, go to the store. And yeah, we're going to start getting into one of my favorite parts of the uh, stockpile as well. We're going to start below, below. And um, 
these are some, like I said, some sanitary items that my girls would use or uh, whatever, you know, between tampons, pads, liners. And again, I do donate a lot of these items, y'all. The closer it gets to school, uh, I have bins. I had two bins that I just recently got rid of with shampoos and conditioners. It might have been three bins. So now um, I'm just kind of restocking to get ready to do, it, do the same thing again. Um, everybody knows how I feel about Pantene. Uh, I love Pantene. Pantene is what I use on my hair. Uh, and I can never get enough of it because, like I said, I'm natural. And I've been natural now for about maybe three and a half years. And um, I've tried several products on my hair. And Pantene works. Aussie, I, I love to use Aussie, uh, especially their co-wash. But my daughter more so uses my, uh, Aussie. And up top is my body wash. Yes, so I have them again by brands. And I have quite a quite amount of some that's some doll and some uh, different brands. But the as you can see, the soft soap, I'm soft soap, 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 soap. I'm really really stocked on. And then um, moving on over here to the bar soap, and it's set up by women and men because I have me and my daughters, and then I have my husband and my son. And even though it's two of them and it's three of us, they have more things in stock than we do. But the most part is because the girls keep their stuff in their rooms. So uh, here is some bar soap, you know, the Irish Spring and the Suave. And the Irish Spring and Dial for them. And then we have the Nivea. And like I said, I like to keep up stock of everything. Down below it are our lotions that you're seeing the, again, Nivea, Suave, and Vaseline lotion. Um couple of bottles of deodorant that I keep on hand just in case and then some pads right there that I forgot to to talk about but again just trying to keep everything on point now down below this is my donation row that all is suave and the smell shaving creams and different things and even this fabric softener here all of that is preparing to go out in bins again uh, I also have another bin that I keep on our shelf but before I get to that big bin yeah I told y'all this is a garage in here I have razors and yes the razors are set. wait a minute what is that big doing in here I need to get that big out of here but my razors are set up as well according to how you know uh, their brands I need to get that big out of that first jar it's gonna it's gonna bother me the rest of the day and uh, thank you I had to get it out y'all I'm sorry um I just that's just how I am and um like I said down below are the men's razors and my son is just really starting to shave so i just had to make sure that my husband had a few of them uh intact and uh like i said um this bin right here uh this is one of the bins that when i go to the store i just throw stuff here constantly i know a lot of children at my church in my community that are in college or in school and um i always like i said i'm always trying to help whoever i can you know, basically, if somebody has a need and they let Savvy Sav know, or somebody in my family knows, or if they have a need either, even, um, I just want to have some things on hand that I know that I can give at any type of uh, moment. Um, like I said, these are just some little things that I have in a bin that's ready to go already. And like I said, shaving cream for the women. I have men down there on the shelf. And um, I don't just give them, you know, off-brand stuff. I give them stuff that I use, too. And so you don't want to just donate stuff that you don't use, but donate things that you like too, because you know, you're going to help that person and you don't want, you know, you can get these things over and over. So we always want to be in a position to help. And I'm very grateful and I'm very thankful to God that I'm in this position to help. So that's about it, everybody. And like I said, I uh, hope you get this video a thumbs up and thanks so much for joining me and stopping by and looking at my little bitty stockpile but hopefully the next one will be really full and impacted but again i don't show that just for a show piece i just wanted to really come on here because that re that request keeps coming so i just stopped what i did was doing and i went ahead and just put it up so and if you're interested in starting your stockpile then i'll be glad to help you again give this video a thumbs up like comment subscribe to my channel this is your girl, Savvy Sav, and I do what I can each and every day to bring you 
the, the discounts and the challenge, the glitches and all of the deals so that we all can save some money. Look at my little all that I forgot to show you guys. Oh my God. But yes, this is my little stockpile here. This is Savvy Sav's stockpile. And I thank you so very much for watching. I thank you guys for supporting me as you do each and every time I upload a video. And until I see you in the store the next time, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for supporting me. Thank you again. Till the next time. Bye.